Hey everyone, in this video, I'm gonna showcase my latest asset on the Unreal Marketplace, the Footstep Sound Component. This asset has two systems, one for footsteps and the other for objects. This is the easiest way to get footsteps and object interaction added to your project to bring some life into your world, so let's get into it. We'll start with footsteps. This only has three steps. Get it? Steps? Feet? Cause, ah, oh, never mind. First step is to add the component to your character. Open the character blueprint, under components, hit add, type FS component, and click this. Second step is to open up their skeleton, add two sockets, footstep underscore L and footstep underscore R. And we're adding these at the feet. Make sure they're spelled exactly like this. Also, rotate the socket in local space so that the blue Z axis is pointing upward and lower the socket to the point where the top of it is barely touching the socket above it. Okay, third step, open up your animations. I'm using the run one and we're gonna to add a notify layer and then we're gonna add the an footstep notify at each point the character's feet touch the ground just like that you're done the character now has footsteps to test this out just hit play and when you run around you're gonna spawn particles for the default surfaces you could test this more by clicking on the surface searching fizz mat and select any of these Let's do grass, hit play, boom! Now you can hear grass and see particles flying everywhere. Now you can use physical materials like this or throw on the actual materials which have the physical materials already added to them and you'll see the same changes. But yeah, that's it, now you have footsteps. Okay, now let's do objects. And guess what? It's even easier. You see this box right here? Click it, add component, FS component, boom! This object now makes sounds and stuff. I would play around with the object impact threshold to fine tune it to your liking. The higher this number, the harder it has to hit things to spawn sounds and particles, and the lower is the opposite. See? So setting this thing to zero, it's gonna go nuts making noise until it's 100% perfectly still. That's all I have for you ladies and gentlemen. I hope you found this video helpful. I'll put out more tutorials covering some of the other aspects touched on the documentation very soon. 